WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of, well, uh, partly sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. we got a bit of a mixed bag. The only mix coming from the Russell 2000, up nearly 9 tenths percent. That's 16 points to the upside. Dow's off 13. S&P's off 13. NASDAQ 100 down 50. That's about 4 tenths percent to the downside. Gold is off $7. Trading out at 1970. It's off 4 tenths. 2 and 3 tenths for silver. Trading down at 23.17, but we are getting a buy signal today. Lights we crude. Trading out at 71.99 that's up 44 pennies natural gas is off two cents trading out at 237 30 treasury is down eight ticks 126.17 is the print there let's take a look at that nine panel market update chart we begin with the es mini upper left hand corner what do we have here well we're still consolidating with inside its daily profile 4206.25 is resistance out there there is no topping pattern just yet Although it does look like you could get a key reversal bar today. So the high, yeah. So you, the low yesterday was 4186, low today 40. Yeah. So you actually have a key reversal bar. And if you get one tick to the downside as far as it's closed, today's open was at uh, 4207.50. So 4207.25 would actually get you a, a sell signal out there. Now the spot volatilics continue to inch higher, but still below its 50-day exponents moving average. That key level to watch is 1834. The case of the NQ, it still has its TD9 count top. Only a close above 13,913 would change that. The US dollar has a TD9 count top. Only a close above 10349 would suggest a further rally. Gold um, is still just consolidating with inside its uh, consolidation range and its new bullish structure daily profile, where it did find support and that's down at the level of about 1980, 1963.70. Resistance at 20.38. As I mentioned, uh, silver is trading uh, lower, but it did form. It will complete a TD9 count bottom today. Now, right now, the low is 23.23. If that's where it stays, any close below that would suggest lower price. Lights we crude continues to find persistent resistance at the center of its daily profile. And that number is 70. 70 356. We get a close above 7356. We're looking at 7770. Natural gas did close two days above its older profile. A new profile has formed. Price has pulled back. It has found support at the center of that bearish structured profile, which can be a buy signal. We've already got a TD9 count bottom inside of natural gas, and a 30 year treasury looks like it wants to get down to make that consolidation measure move somewhere around the 124. 30 ish type range out there. Steve Rhodes with TFNN. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you have to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. And thanks so much for joining us.